the most amazing people in California who are working so hard. And I know you're here today. I know California's in the house. <laughs> yes. And I, it, it, every month, hearing new news coming out, new, you know, well, there's no research. Well, you won't let us research because it's a schedule one, you know, and, and, and the whole hypocrisy of the whole paradigm. And that's why I'm calling this speech uh, the cannabis paradigm because that's what we're doing is changing the paradigm. Not to, and not just cannabis. Cannabis is the leader, is the is the is the the thing that's going to push the whole conversation about health. And that's that's what women, that's why women grow is so important. That's why it's so important that you are here. Because what is missing on the you, cannabis health on the larger level is the balance of the, the matriarch and the patriarch and the, and the feminine energy in, in our whole paradigm, in our, in our whole, let's get a little spiritual and, and, <laughs> and, and talk about that. But that's what is changing in the world right now. And cannabis being the female plant, being the female spirit that we know is pushing this, is, is demanding the attention, is, is proving itself over and over. It is bringing back what we lost, that, that pagan knowledge that we had of medicine, of wellness, of all that stuff that, that we were burned at the stake for, you know? <laughs> And so we find ourselves in 2016, a place where, where when I even tell, I have a 18 year, a 19, no, yes, 19, oh my God, 19 year old daughter. And when I tell her, she's going to Columbia University, I just want to brag. She's in a women's studies class, she's gonna rock the world, oh God, just tell me. Because when I start telling her, oh, well, back in the 60s, uh, women couldn't even get a credit card. She's like, what? I'm like, yeah. I mean, she's just, you know, when, when, 